our trip at Rich Loam General Store. We ran a little bit late getting up here. We got behind a slow person on 33. We're not on a real schedule and not on a real route, but we're just gonna go ride around up in the north part of Rich Loam. If you're gonna come into Rich Loam, you need to stop at the general store in Rich Loam. This store is pretty much as it was 100 years ago. It's one of the last remaining buildings in the town of Rich Loam, which was a boom town back in the day for the lumber and the turpentine industry. And matter of fact, there used to be railroad tracks that are right over here near the store. And there was a train station, a school, a church. Mm -hmm. And uh, now there's this cool little store where you can get all kinds of old school ice candies, cream. ice cream, games, <laughs> canned goods. So support a local business. We'll see you on the ride. Welcome to Florida Deep Rides and Off-Road Travels. We're going to be on channel 12 today and we have my family riding with the grandkids. And for all the people who ask, do we ever take something other than a Jeep out on it? Yeah. We got a full-size F350 diesel truck riding trails with us today. And then, picking up the very tail, is Steve. And, and we have a passenger somewhere back there too. <laughs> Plus, you also got your dogs with yes, you, too. Yes, we do. So, He's in the back. Uh, that guy is... Pulling. Thanks, buddy. I'm standing in the road here. But we're probably going to stick to some of the more main roads uh, to stay out of the hunter's way. But we'll see what this trail brings us. The dogs coming right now? No, no, okay. Right. okay. Bye. Bye. Introduction to that little trail there is a water crossing. As you can see, it was kind of a little bit deep. Caught me off guard because I wasn't even in full wheel drive. There's a big rut in the middle of it, uh, which caused me to stall with my muffler underwater, blub, blub, blub. So it gave me a little issue on restarting there, like I kind of had low battery feeling to it. But overall, if you stay to the main roads out here, they're kind of maintained and pretty easy. But if you go on any of the little side roads that you're allowed at certain times of the year to be on, uh, you're going to be greeted with some great mud hole opportunities. Uh, we are finishing out hunting season today, so there are hunters out here. It's 2.35 in the afternoon. New so Year's we Day. New Year's Day, and this is our New Year's Day trail ride. Normally we go somewhere that we've never been before, but what I didn't think about is that this New Year's Day is Sunday and we are pastors of a church. So we started our day off by holding a church service with a breakfast in which Randy made some really good egg casseroles, uh, including one 
it had spam hash, brown, hash, hash browns, browns and spam and boy was that <laughs> good Interesting. I'm in the red Jeep and look what just came on. <laughs> Traction control, brake, and ABS. Merry Christmas. Both Jeeps now match. <laughs>
exiting uh, the Rich Lome area and we're heading down into the Green Swamp. Now, in Florida, we have our own version of a Sasquatch. We call it the Skunk Ape because apparently anytime he's around, there's a strong musk smell that smells a lot like a skunk. So if you're ever out here in the woods four wheeling, especially at night, and you start to smell a skunk, be careful, because that just might be the skunk cape. evidence and to this day if you can ever get back there you can go to the cabin that still stands and next to the cabin is two graves with their names on it and the story that tells about how that they were murdered by their grandkids by axe trails for central rich long number one it is packed out with hunters that's coming to an end hunting season is about to end two there's a little bit of mud a little bit of water but we didn't even have any issues we got a full-size board with us today how was it it was good have fun okay, so yeah like get muddy not inside no mud it's not muddy Well, thanks for joining us today. I'm Matt. I'm Steve. Celine. I'm Lori. And I'm Randy. <laughs> and this has been a Florida Jeep ride slash off-road travels because we've got somebody who's not in the Jeep with us today. <laughs> thanks for riding. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below.